The Tokyo Olympics and Paralympic Games are officially in the rear view mirror, and it was a roller coaster ride for so many Arizona athletes, setting records, historic firsts, and bringing home some gold medals back to our state. One of the biggest standout Arizona Olympians, gold medal gymnast Jade Carey. First at four, Jade sits down with our sister station in Portland, Oregon, to discuss her journey to the top and the road ahead. I'm so excited that I'm finally here. I feel like I've been waiting for forever. What a trip. An inspiration. An Olympic gold medalist and first pitch expert. We got to start with that first pitch. <laughs> Jade Carey has made it to Corvallis. Ever since I stepped on this campus, I just knew that it was going to be the place for me. Committed to Oregon State in 2017, Carey deferred her enrollment for the Olympic Games in Tokyo where she experienced the highs and lows of competition in front of the world. She was a favorite on the vault, but a mistake on her first attempt took her out of contention, finishing last. Really felt like the worst day of my life, but I kind of just had to push it to the side and not really think about it because I knew that I still had one more chance. And even my dad said the morning of floor, like yesterday may have felt like the worst day of your life, but we could make today the best. So I kind of just kept thinking about that over and over again, like we could really make today the best day ever, and we did. <laughs> what a comeback. A gold medal performance on the floor. I think it was one of the best floor routines I've ever done in my life, so I knew that I gave it everything I had. Sharing that joy with her father by her side as coach. That meant everything to me to be able to have him out there with me. We've been through so much together, and. It's been a really long journey and a really long process, so for it to all pay off and do it together was really awesome. What did you learn about yourself that maybe you didn't know? I was able to prove to myself and everyone how strong of a person I am. Inside the new 20,000-foot Oregon State practice facility, her name already among Beaver's greats. The program's first Olympic gold medalist. After years of planning, she's ready for this chapter in her life. Just living the college life, I'm feeling a little bit more normal. Um, but I'm also really excited to compete for Oregon State and represent this school and be a part of a team. And looking ahead to 2022, we are 20 weeks away from the start of the Beijing 2022 Winter Olympics. Opening ceremonies are scheduled for February 4th, just two days before the Super Bowl. You can watch both the Olympics and the Super Bowl right here on 12 News.